What's up guys, Supergeek here. Today I'm going to tell you how you can install Android 13 on your Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 and Note 8T. Android 13 is still weeks away from the final release, but some developers are working their way to bring it to some smartphones before the final release. First, let me tell you something about the custom ROM itself and then I'll tell you how you can install it on your smartphone. So, the Pixel UI 13 ROM is basically the first Android 13 beta that was released by Google for Pixel smartphones. And one of the XDA developer member has ported that beta to your Redmi Note 8 and 8D. This custom room will give you a lot of features and performance bump as well on your Redmi Note 8 and 8D. This custom room is perfect for daily driver as no serious bugs has been reported yet. And the best part about this custom room is that you get all the Pixel exclusive features from Pixel smartphones on your smartphone using this custom ROM. Now let me tell you about how you can install the custom ROM on your Redmi Note 8 or 8T. So the first thing that you need to do is unlock the bootloader on your Xiaomi smartphone and then install a custom recovery on it. I recommend you to install TWRP custom recovery since it's the most popular one and you'll find it easily for your smartphone. Well in Xiaomi smartphones Unlocking the bootloader is very tricky, so if you want to know how you can do that, follow this simple guide on Supergeek web blog. The link is in the description. The guide also includes how you can install custom recovery, so it will help you a lot. Well, the guide includes this, but let me tell you that unlocking the bootloader will wipe your smartphone's internal memory. So make sure you create a backup of all the data first. Once you have unlocked the bootloader on your smartphone, and install a custom recovery, all you need to do is download the custom ROM zip package and move that zip package on your smartphone's internal memory. Once you do that, reboot your smartphone to custom recovery mode. To do that, all you have to do is turn off your smartphone and turn it back on by pressing and holding the power button and volume up key. And keep on holding till you see the TWRP custom recovery logo. Now, once you are in the recovery, tap the wipe option and swipe to wipe the internal memory of your smartphone. Now, go back and tap on install button and then select the Android 13 custom ROM package and then swipe to install it on your smartphone. It will take some time and once it's done, tap on reboot to system button and your phone will boot to Android 13. The first boot may take some time like about 10 minutes and you'll see the welcome screen very soon. If you don't see the welcome screen even after 10 minutes, then force turn off your smartphone by holding down the power key and volume up key and repeat the process. Alright, now you have Android 13 running on your smartphone even before the final release. So that's it for today guys. Hope you liked the video. Hit the like button, get subscribed and I'll see you in the next one.